Hey guys, this is Ken from Mahalo.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you the top keyboard shortcuts in iTunes. Let's go ahead and take a look at the top keyboard shortcuts in iTunes. Well, one is Spacebar. And that's going to play my selected song. Now, here's a tip. Spacebar is pretty much the universal keyboard shortcut to play your media in any iLife program. And along with the Spacebar, on your Apple keyboard, F8 is another way to play your music. And a cool thing about F8, let's say you're on, you know, surfing the internet, you can hit F8 and that's going to play your music in iTunes. Another play option is Return. So Return is going to play your song that you have selected from the beginning. I hit spacebar to stop and you see it's at one second. I hit Return and it takes it back to the beginning. So if there's a song that you like and you want to hear it again before it ends, just hit Return. Another great one is is option shift and we click on this wheel here and that's how you create a smart playlist if you don't hold that you create a regular playlist as you can see untitled playlist 4 so let's command Z and undo that feature so just remember hold option shift and you can see this little guy right here changes and then um, to create a new playlist so hit Command N, and there it is, Untitled Playlist number 5. Let's go back to our music, and then let's say I'm playing this song. Just by hitting Command and up on my arrows, I can lower or raise the volume. One really cool one, let's hit Space. And Command T opens up my visualizer. And along with that, I'll hit Command F, and that puts it in full screen mode. And then I just hit one, Escape, and that'll take me out of full screen mode. And if I ever get stuck in iTunes and need some help, and I'm not there to help you, hit Command, Shift, question mark, and that brings up the help menu. One great one is Command B. And you can see right here, it composed the list of artists. So I can go ahead and compilations, Alfonso, Emil LaRoe, Anthony Hamilton. And this is a great way to search if you're just looking for your favorite artist. This really helps if you have a huge iTunes library. And if you just want to search for Bob Marley, well, I can just go ahead and look for B, Bob Marley. There we go. Well, this has been Ken from Mahalo.com, and thank you for watching. If you guys have any requests for videos, go ahead and send them to request at Mahalo.com.